Row milk. Jack, the time ready. All right, ready? Go. Hello, welcome to my milk speed run. The point of the speed run is to go to the store, get milk, and come back as fast as I can. And I think I did a pretty good job. All right, so why am I going on the stairs instead of the elevator? Well, I'm pretty sure stairs are basically always faster. Uh, on, at least on the way down, on the way up, it's a different story, which I'll, I'll get to later. Uh, but like, waiting for the elevator, having to go down, and ex waiting for it to open is like, I think always slower. Not to mention that like, there's a back entrance here, which I can't get to from the elevator as fast as I can the stairs. So, at least going down, stairs are absolutely faster. All right. Uh, this is my second run doing this. Uh, first one I wasn't that happy with, so I didn't post it. But it's my second time, and I'm pretty happy with this one. You saw me there, I realized I, I had a bag. I brought a bag with me. I don't need a bag. I'm getting one item, so... I just put that away. It didn't cost me that much time, but like maybe like a second. Alright. So, two extra rules in this run is... Be safe, don't endanger your safety, and don't be an asshole to people around you. Uh, so, like, you see me watching out for cars, like, looking both ways. Uh, and slowing down when I'm going past people to not disturb them. And also just walking in the grocery store. Uh, you see I'm, go I'm going through this parking lot. Uh, I didn't do this on my first run. I didn't do it on the way there. I realized I could do it on the way back. But it does save a lot of time. It saves like 30 seconds. So definitely the best strategy here. Definitely the best routing. Uh, looking both ways, crossing the street. And then there's people on the other side. So I slow down a little bit and to push past them. It doesn't cost me much time. Like It costs me like a second maybe. And then parking lot number two. Uh, this one's more active. Uh, so I look out to see that no one's gonna pull out and hit me. And they didn't. I don't know where the honk came from. I, n none of these cars are moving. I don't know who honked at me. Uh, but yeah. You see me slowing down a little bit here. At this point, I am a little bit winded, so... So you can see me here slowing down as I enter the store. Again, don't be an asshole to people around you. You gotta walk inside the store. You can you can speed walk, but don't run in the grocery store. That's just a... Alright, so the routing in the grocery store is something that I could improve on. Like, definitely. Like, that's the number one area for improvement on this run. Uh, is the grocery store. Because I thought they roped off the checkouts that weren't being used at the moment. So I couldn't go through there. Turns out, I was wrong. You can just walk through there. And it makes it a lot faster than going around in a big circle. So, if I ever did this again, that's where I'd improve. But, uh, you see me coming up on the milk here. I usually go for Umpqua, 2%. Uh, just personal preference. It's local, it's cheap, it, it's fine, it's milk. Uh, I do break my no being asshole rule a little bit here by pushing past this employee. Uh, I thought I could make it with Sorry. more than I did. I <laughs> she didn't seem to mind, so I, mean, I count it. It doesn't ruin the run. So the biggest luck part of this run is whether or not there's going to be an open register. And there was. There was one completely open, so I took that one. Uh, yeah. This is where the camera goes into my pocket, because checking out is a two-hand job, and also I don't want you seeing my debit card number. Yeah. So you, you just gotta imagine what the strategy's like here. It's not that hard. You just, like, know what's coming, be ready with your finger, and... It's all just practice and execution. I, I did pretty well. I might be able to improve, like, a second, but, like, I'm happy with it. All right, so on the way back. At this point, the way back is harder because I am very winded, but it's basically the same. Uh, same route, uh, same issues with like looking both ways, make sure I don't get hit, hit by a car. Uh, yes. They honk at me here too. I don't know why. I don't know who honked at me. The, the cars were all still. They were all parked. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, so you might be thinking, hey, Henry, you said you value your privacy, but aren't you basically doxing yourself with this video? Like, we can figure out where you live now. Uh, that's true, uh, but luckily, I'm uploading this on the day that I move out of this apartment, so you can't dox me, so get fucked. Please don't show up to the apartment where I formerly lived, and bother the person who lives there now. They'll be very confused, and probably annoyed and scared, so don't do that, please. Yeah, you see someone with a basketball speedrun uh, in front of me here. Hope you did well. Sorry for the cinematography, uh, holding the camera steady was not my... <laughs> Uh, was not my top priority here. So, apologies. Alright, you're about to see my strategy on the way up. Um, last run I did, I took the elevator, because I'll be faster, because I am very winded and I, and I can't run up the stairs. Uh, this run I went up the stairs, because my previous run I was waiting at the elevator for, like, an entire minute, so... 
yeah, oh, a little bit of strategy here. Uh, I have the key fob in my pocket, and I'm just the right height that I can just put my thigh up to the sensor, and it opens. So that's nice. That's a bit of natural advantage I have. Unlike my athleticism, which is not enough to sustain me running across the parking lot two times and then going up the stairs. This is as fast as I'm going. So yeah, the elevator could be faster in, a, in, a, in an ideal situation where there's no one else waiting for it and it's right on the bottom for me waiting when I get back, but it's just, it's not going to happen. It's, it could happen, but I'm not going to risk it. This, the stairs, they're slower in, in the ideal situation for the elevator, but they're consistent at least, and I knew I'd get an improvement over my previous run because the elevator was where that run pretty much died. It was the world record still, because I'm the only one who does this, but, you know. I'm pretty satisfied with this run. Uh, ended up saving about a minute over my previous run. You see me getting my keys out of my pocket here, and the most clumsy mistake of the run happens right about now. I drop my keys and pick them back up. It's fine. It lasts like a second there. It's, it's all right. But yeah, I saved almost a minute there. Uh, short by a couple seconds. But I'm pretty happy with that run. Uh, I'm never going to beat it, because again, I'm moving out of this apartment. Uh, so, this is where, where the run will stay. The record will stay. Thank you for watching. This is a dumb video. <laughs>